Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today we are starting off the other SMP Season 1, which is going to be a lot of fun, I hope, and we'll see. Yeah, we're going to make it a lot of fun. Anyways, I've logged on the server before. I did a stream, which was episode 0, and uh, if you missed it, I will give you a quick walkthrough of what happened. So to start off the server, I logged in, and I looked around, but I'd already known the seed because I checked it out beforehand. And so I started off in the direction that I wanted to go build my base. This direction was north, so we started running north past a huge mountain and made our way to a forest a little bit from spawn. So after running over here, I decided that this would be a good spot for my base, which I had honestly already seen because I had looked at the seed before but i decided to set up shop up on this hill where it was a pie I, I don't know why i just decided to dig a hole here so this is a little tour of my house i got a dog i think i did that actually between stream and recording this uh on my way back from where i was when i ended the stream um we don't talk about those and then just a little bit of stuff so Really nothing too much, but I found that in a chest while exploring on stream. Once again, if you want to see all the, the details, go check out the stream. It was, a, it was a good time. Let's talk about plans for this episode. So as per usual, uh, when you start a new Minecraft world, the first thing you have to do is do some mining and then some crafting. And we've done a little bit of mining and a little bit of crafting, but it's time to do some more of the mining aspect. So we're going to see how much stuff we can get in one hour of mining, which I think that's a pretty common thing to do. Geared up for some mining, and we're going to go find a cave and see what we can do in one hour. So guys, I've been down in the mines for a while, and uh, I got some stuff. Come take a look. So, after my one hour of mining, I got 27 diamond, 39 gold, 11 copper, plus all of this copper, a bunch of redstone, some lapis, and a, an okay amount of iron. But I also found a few monster spawners, so I did find some name tags, saddle, music disc, a golden apple, and a silk touch pick, uh, silk touch, uh, book, which is great. But the name tags do mean that I can give this guy a name. So leave down in the comments what you guys think I should name my dog. So I've gone ahead and I've crafted all my diamonds up into diamond gear. So we're looking nice and fine, but that means we can move on to the next part of starting a brand new survival Minecraft world which is enchantments. Now, I don't really want to uh, worry too much about getting villagers right away. I know some of the other guys are, so I think I'll just leave that to them. And I'm going to focus on getting just an enchantment table and some basic enchantments going. So to do that, I'm going to need some leather, and I'm also going to need a source of XP. Now, if you remember, as I said earlier, I did find a spawner, actually a couple, while I was mining. So I'm going to head back to there where I saved the cords and get those looking to be more like an XP farm. And here we are. There we go, worked perfectly. 
And so we can start clearing this area out and turning it into a mob farm. So there we are. I have cleared out this area other than obviously these chests, which I guess I can just get rid of right now. There we go. And now it's time to turn this into a functional spawner. I feel like I've said that multiple times at this point. But we're going to start by blocking off these walls. Just like that. And then we need to make a water funnel. So I've gone ahead and I've filled in all the water here. Now we do have a dilemma, which is there. And that is all the way at bedrock. So we're going to have to transfer the mobs up. Which is fine because that'll allow us to add a drop chute. But to do that, we're going to have to head to the nether. Now I remember, well, I think I remember, there was a portal over here somewhere. Someone had made a portal in one of the lava pools. So we're going to go check that out. Here we go. A nether portal. Let's enter the nether for the very first time on Other SMP Season 1. Okay, I haven't been killed yet, so it wasn't an instant death. We need to find some soul sand. I think... Is there soul sand in Basalt Deltas? Okie Dana. Um... Yeah, we, well, let's find some soul sand. Okay, we're gonna go up... Up and around this way. Might go check out what that other portal is too. Oh, there's an there's another portals popping up all over the place. I'm late to the party. We'll have to hopefully there's a sign that'll tell me whose base this is. Is there a sign? No, there's a there's a few people online, so we'll see. Hello? Anybody home? Oh, there's some wheat over here. This is most definitely where someone seems to be living. Hmm. Oh, and there's a house over there. Anybody home? Hopefully this wasn't a friendly skeleton. He, he's dead. No sign. Oh, they got a wolf. There's just cherry logs lying everywhere. Oh, a sorts. Is this a sorts' house? Cool, cool, cool. Well, let's, uh... Let's head back to the nether. You only need one piece, but I'll take two just to be safe. And let's get out of here before I die. So, I was working on this, and then uh, the other guy showed up. Hello. Hello. Um, This is my beautiful zombie farm, can't you tell? It's a work in progress. Yeah, I, uh, I see that. I'm going to take this gold, actually. You kind of you know, left some valuable stuff down here. I guess that's oh, not I, technically I stealing, cause uh, you know, can't can't call it's it stealing. It's naturally you know? generated. Yep. So, uh, w what did you call me down here for? Kind of need to. Yeah. What's, what's going on? Uh, you were at my house, and then you're like, "Hi, I'm at your house." And it's like you should come check this out. Yeah, but what am I checking out? <laughs> this beautiful mob spawn. I, uh, quick question. Uh, why so slow? Cause there's torches. Anyways, seems the, like excuses. It was interesting that the other guy was near. Other guy was nearby because he lives like a million miles away. So you want to like show me to yes, your base? Yes, I I oh, am go. quite far away, but uh, I I gotta admit, there's not a lot there right now. Okay. I'm I'm very much stuck in this water column because I cannot swim up. <laughs> you. I miss my elytra so much. <laughs> yeah, I've actually enjoyed not having elytra. I don't enjoy these iron pickaxes, but you know. You should really uh, connect your base to the Nether network. You know, I will. It, I was. I was literally. I was in the Nether today, and I was like, "Wow, I am so far behind as far as portals go." Yeah, but there's the thing. You're not really that far behind in terms of gear. I played for so many hours, and I'm still doing worse than you. So, this is worse true. might be an exaggeration, but I'm not doing much better. Yeah, I only have. I've got a diamond sword and a diamond pickaxe, but. Neither of them have, I have any enchantments. I have enchanting table, pickaxe, shovel, and pickaxe. Nice. If you want to That's move your enchanting table over to my uh, XP farm. No. 
Mm -mm, I'm okay. I've just been mining quartz. I feel like it's faster for me to mine quartz than come all the way to your base. Nice. So, uh, yeah, this is my base right here. I've got an uh, empty island with nothing on it. Cool. That's about all I can uh, see. My base, is actually, uh, my, my base is actually over here. My starter base, at least. Uh, I, I am going to be building a, a lighthouse on that island, for sure. Don't worry about it. It's not going to take me forever to get done. Uh, <laughs> for now, oh, though, my base is starting to load uh, in. Yeah, this stuff here. Why so much sugar cane? Uh, f villagers mostly. <laughs> Any good trades? <laughs> Mini skulk. Mini diamond blocks. Uh, this is my casa. I've got my uh my trees here. Uh, my cows are over there in that pen. They're not uh, that important. Nice. Uh, th my villagers. Uh, is this your state-of-the-art elevator? Yep, and it's a pretty cracked villager setup in here. I got about five villagers, I think. Nice. And yeah, my enchantment table. Nice. And I have a little hut over here that has absolutely all my stuff in it. Wow. So, yep, this, uh, this is actually two people worth of stuff in here. Just gonna take some of this. Oh. Okay, I guess. Thank you. Have a good day. You just so you know, robbery is illegal. Uh, no, stealing is illegal. Robbery is perfectly fine. Trust me, they're different. Yep. Well, uh, hopefully next time I see you uh, at my base, I'll have a something to show you because sounds kinda good. Underwhelming right now. You mind if I take this boat? Uh yeah, you can steal it. It's fine. I've I've got so many extras. Okay. Thank you. Have a good day, sir. You too. We're in a Discord call. We're not getting any farther apart vocally. Just pretend like you are. <laughs> so I did some more work and I decided I'm going to call this a free use farm. So anybody who stumbles across it is more than welcome to use it. And uh, yeah, it's so basic. I don't think it's worth keeping private, but I did almost complete it. I just need to add a crafting table right here. A few slaps. And then, to come down here, place in the soul sand, and my two signs. And now, all the mobs should get shoved up here, carried along over, and drop down the pit. Pro clutch. Anyways, let's break the lights off this bad boy and see... How it goes. There we go. Wait, is this a spider spawner? 